The question was asked one time, as I remember, am I my brother's keeper? My answer to that was always a resounding yes. How many federal judges can you name? I bet that if you can name only one, it is Judge Miles Lord of the Federal District Court. He was the judge who didn't mind, and matter of fact, enjoyed standing up to rich people and big corporations. He became one of the best known judges in America, I think, during those times. And Judge Lord was one of those people that he could walk into a situation that he could ask about 10 or 15 questions and he would get right to the heart of an issue. I had the impression of being a judge who, when he made up his mind, meant it. I don't think there's any use of being a judge if you don't decide anything. If you've got on that job to be a judge, then judge. When somebody's right, tell them they're right. When somebody's wrong, tell them they're wrong. You listen to me, please. You seem to be in charge. The judge will be the referee here. You answer the questions. If you don't do that, consequences may follow. Judge Lord always took a side, and it was kind of easy to tell what side. <laughs> Lawyers for Robbins objected to Judge Lord's statement, saying he was prejudiced. The judge told Robbins, I certainly am, and that about winds me up. Miles viewed his job as a judge as no less than saving the world. I've been accused of being a busybody or an activist or reaching to help people. I have to let sympathy, passion influence me. He has taught so many people how to really search their souls for being an advocate. When people are looking all over this world for places to hide pollutants, industrial wastes that may do some good, but will in the long run kill us. I cannot compromise. He had really strong principles and values about what's really important to people. I thought Miles was, he was the best thing to happen to the judiciary in the United States. And I was proud he was from Minnesota and an Iron Ranger to boot, you know. I happen to believe that might does not make right. I believe that the poor are blessed and that we have a duty to help them.